YouTube. YouTube, what's going on? How are you cool cobras doing? I just got back from Colorado. Got my uh, pre-op taken care of. I'll be getting eye surgery on uh, the 3rd of September. They're going to do surgery on my right eye. Oh, the pre-op went re really good. What's up, Deathbed Tapes? Right now, I have a splash of the good stuff. We got some Bacardi Gold and some Coca-Cola. But I did pour myself a mixed drink. Oh, yeah. How am I feeling about the surgery? Nah, I'm okay with it. It'll help me see better. It'll help me see better, and I'll be able to legally drive, so that'll be cool. What's up, Richie Rell? Challenge master in the house. I got some people on my side that know a thing or two, and they've been informing me of some of the real trolls out there and who the real trolls are. So that, that I know what I know, the ball's in my court. Now that I know what I know, I'm going to pretend like I don't know and see how the see who the real fans are. But right now, we're doing a uh, rant on this incident that happened. Rest in peace, Canon Henant, who was a five-year-old who um, was shot and killed by a sick piece of shit excuse of a human being. And the only, the only comfort in this story is knowing that the person who shot Cannon is in jail without bond, which means he cannot be released. Thank you for the three ninety nine. Can you shout out my boy? Uh, uh, shout out to Bean S Meat. Thank you for the um, donation. I appreciate it. Um, I'm still a male, by the way. Uh, the surgery was pre-op, and it's for my eyeball. But you know what, troll? Thank you for the money. I appreciate it. I own these goddamn trolls, dude. They're paying me money to talk shit on a live stream. And they think, I'll watch. He'll, he'll ban me. Uh, trolls can talk all the shit they want, but they're just jealous of me, and that's why they do what they do. I'm out here pouring my heart out on a decent video, talking about some really depressing shits, going off on a much-needed rants, and they don't care. They're like, eh, let's troll Cobra. This will be hilarious. Yeah, keep it up, assholes, because um, I get big enough in Hollywood, I tell you what, all these fucking trolls are going down. Now, at some point, I will be taking an undisclosed break from making YouTube videos. It's for like 10 days. I got a uh, script coming in for the cartoon, and that's all I'm going to say on that. Yep. What's going to happen then when I become a famous voice actor and end up getting, like, jobs on a bunch of different cartoons? This is real life, YouTube, and I'm taking off. Time to spread my demon wings and fly. Doc, thank you for, for the, uh, or Dot, thank you for the $5. Your lips are still big and stained. Maybe you should get surgery and... <laughs> uh, no, my lips are not stained, but yes, I do have big lips. But I don't care. Uh, my buddy Alex Campbell came over with this big-ass bottle of alcohol, and he's like, you want it? I'm like, yeah, man, totally. People are so quick to talk shit about Warlord, but... He brings over alcohol and cigarettes when he can, you know, and that's the best part of it. I don't expect my friends to do those things for me. If anything, I'm the kind of person that likes to share with my friends. It's the truth. <sighs> yes. Dude, my heart weighs heavier than a church bell right now. This is just so sad, dude. I'll play the, uh, the video here. We'll watch it right quick. Even the news anchor lady reporting the story is trying not to cry, dude. This is heart-wrenching. Seven o'clock at Shingleton Funeral Home. Police charged 25-year-old Darius Sessoms with first-degree murder and is being held without bond. Time now for first word. Have you ever dated another dark arts master? 
Um, kind of. Would I date an of age chick who's into the dark arts like I am? Fuck yeah, I would. And that's honestly why I'm not bitching about my dry spell. You know, that'll happen when it happens. No sense in rushing it. There's honestly a lot more depressing shit going on in our society right now, and that's that's where I'm getting at. I've seen the way the adult women check me out around town, so, you know, it's, you know, it's only a matter of time, man. And I sat here on YouTube saying, one day I'm going to get discovered, and now I'm starting to get discovered. So if you have a loved one that you care about, you know, appreciate them, because tomorrow's not promised. I didn't say dated. I asked if you dueled. Ah, my bad. Yeah, that's why I need cataract surgery on my right eye. But have I dueled somebody with dark powers? Um, I've dueled several people who claimed to have mastered the occult. But when they go up against me, they find that they're outmatched. I don't think people fully realize how powerful of a practitioner I really am. And I find it amusing when they underestimate my true dark powers. You know why people troll me, YouTube? Because they want to be me so bad. They're like, this guy's a badass demon warlock, and he's the most powerful one in the universe at that. And on top of that, he makes cool wands. Chicks dig him, despite the fact that he has Asperger's. And generally speaking, I'm more well-liked by my peeps than most of my trolls. I got a lot of people who really care about me, and these trolls have nobody. Their lives are miserable. They have nothing. So instead of working to make their life better, they're going to work on ruining mine. And when it doesn't work, it just pisses them. It does, YouTube, and, you know, it's sad. But honestly, the only thing sadder than my trolls is hearing about kids like Cannon getting shot. Dude, that's just beyond sad dude like, i can deal with asshole trolls all day every day but hearing about an innocent kid getting shot and killed is just it's heartbreaking dude yeah you know what in some sick twisted way that actually makes me appreciate being single shout out to all the single parents out there and to the parents in general raising a kid in today's effed up society cannot be easy thank you for the 199 when does the Comedy Central show start. Um, I will not disclose that. The only thing you need to know is I'm on a cartoon doing voiceover work for a show on Comedy Central. And my manager slash friend Chaz has hired me for for this. And that's all you need to know. You don't need to know shit outside of that. And when you see a show on Comedy Central and you recognize yours truly's voices voice on one of the characters, you're gonna be like no fucking way. Cobra wasn't lying. Wow. Color me shocked. Apparently, according to Chaz, a lot of Hollywood celebrities watch my videos, which I think is pretty sweet. They don't have to give me shout outs. Just the fact that I've, you know, made such an impact on the world that I got big time celebrities who are like, oh, sweet. Another Cobra video. I tell you what. Uh, if I would have seen that asshole trying to shoot Cannon, I would have shot the asshole before he shot Cannon. Trust and believe that. If I would have been there with my double barrel shotgun and I seen some asshole trying to shoot a kid, I'd shoot him in his goddamn face, I would. But listen here, motherfucker. Children are innocent to the world's bullshit. What the fuck's your problem? I wouldn't do it for the fame. I wouldn't do it for the recognition. I'd do it because it's the right thing to do. The only thing that stops a bad guy with a gun is a good guy with a gun. I know. In fact, Chaz sent me a couple of cool photos on the uh, cell phone of his earlier. He was going to get a couple of his cars cleaned and detailed, and he took a picture of a rather large raven just sitting there staring at him on the side of the road. He's like, bro, check this out. Believe me, my dad looked up Chaz. He is who he says he is. Right now, my trolls are super jealous and anxious because I got discovered by a big-time Hollywood executive, and now my trolls are just steaming pissed. They're like, shit, 
Cobra may not have to wait until he wins the lottery to build his clock tower dream house now. Damn it. If he gets famous enough and makes enough money, he can just build it himself and not have to worry about playing the system like that. To make me feel alive. So, um, yeah, of course, splash of that Bacardi Gold, just like that. A little shot in the glass right there. I don't know what you fucking whiskers, man. And Coors Banquet Beer. Then you get these fucking assholes who are just like, oh my god, you're drinking Rocky Mountain piss water. And I'm like, you know what, guy? Go fuck yourself. You know, you know, you don't see me trash talking your beer or whatever beer you're fucking drinking at the moment. It's fucking dumb. I got a heart of gold, dude. I try to have a heart of gold. I try to be a decent person. Even when the world can be shitty to me or treat other people like shit, I say to myself, you know what? No, I'm above the shit. These trolls picking on me, fucking idiots doing stupid shit. We don't need to fucking riot to make our fucking point be heard. That's what these fucking stupid white racist pieces of shit don't fucking realize. All these fucking assholes commenting, oh, okay, <laughs> where's the riots for canon now? Like, dude, first of all, fuck you, you piece of... Ooh, dude, don't even get me started. Breathe. <sighs> first of all, rioting is not going to solve anything. Second of all, these fucking pieces of shit who are just influenced by what the fuck they see on the fucking the media, and they, they were influenced all the wrong fucking ways. They sit there and go, uh, you know what I'm saying? that These people... For the world to see that we all can live with love and peace. And now, please, YouTube, join me in a moment of silence for... Thank you for watching me rant and rave on this much-needed live stream. So, a moment of silence, if you will. Thank you for absorbing that moment of silence with me. I appreciate it. <sighs> I do appreciate y'all turning in to watch the video. Watching me bitch and rant and rave. And, yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you, Cool Cobras, later.